Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Kladish. Eid ul Adha Mubarak to everybody who is watching. So I pulled this foundation less blue eyeliner makeup look using eyeshadow and only concealer palette by H&M. So do watch it till the end because I'm going to show you what I'm wearing today for Eid. So it is a lovely dress by Generation. So how I did this, let's jump right into the video. First, let me clean my face using this Nivea micellar water to have a clean skin and I'm going to use this wet and wild palette and H&M concealer palette so let me moisturize my lips and for the skin I'm using this Nivea cream daytime cream which has SPF 20 in it and this is jelly like cream and it gives a nice glow which I have noticed so i'm using this garnier roll-on i'm not a big fan of the product inside but i really like the metallic ball on it which reduces puffiness so let's start our look first i'm going to grab this lighter shade from this palette is it palette or what do we call it i'm going to start from my under eyes and then i'm going to gradually spread it all over my cheekbones and where i usually put the concealer so i am going to put it beside my nose and also below my brows to define my brows the idea is to have a foundationless effortless makeup look we are going to put an effort but it will look like that you didn't put in any effort so i'm going to grab the darkest shade from this palette and i'm going to use it as a contour uh, but when i put it on my skin as you can tell it is not so dark so it didn't do a lot of contouring so i'm using it as i usually do beside the bridge of my nose and beside the cheeks to contour my face so i'm going to buff it everything using the beauty blender now our face is ready i'm going to use this banana powder by essence to put it under my eyes because there is going to be a fallout by the eyeshadow which we're going to use it as uh, a liner so first of what i'm going to do i'm going to put on the eyeliner as you can see how i do it first i start with the front of my eye and gradually connecting the dots and creating a very thin line and now what i'm going to do i'm going to follow the shape of my eyes the lower lash line and the shape of my eye and i'm going to draw the line following that line if your eyes are straight you have to draw a straight line if your eyes are a little upward like mine so follow the same uh, shape of your eyes it will look better so i'm going to repeat the same on the other eye creating the this beautiful eyeliner first so don't worry if it is not so precise you can you are going to put on uh, you're going to run the blue line over it so in the end it will come out nice and precise now i'm going to strap this blue shade on my liner brush and i am going to follow the same uh, same line which we have created with the eyeliner uh, why i use the black liner before putting on this blue because it is going to hold it also the blue will pop out you are going to build the blue color and uh, when you are happy you're going to stop so i am building it up i want the blue to pop out so i'm grabbing blue shade um and then i am running it over the black eyeliner uh, eyeliner sorry which we had put on earlier so i'm going to repeat the same on the other eye and you will see in a while how the blue shade is going to pop out so i am running it over the black liner 
now I'm going to clean up any fallout using the concealer so our under eyes are clean and now I'm going to use my MAC mineralized powder to have a finished look I want the cat eye elongated kind of look so I want to make it precise so what I did I took the concealer brush and I took some concealer on it and I'm going to clean I'm going to clean any streaks so now I'm going to use the eyelash curler and I'm going to use the false lashes today for today's look because it's all about eyes once my lashes are dry I use the same eyelash curler to curl my eyelashes so it gives a more natural look and you can see the difference so I'm going to repeat the same I'm going to put on the eyelash curl it and then I thought I needed a little bit of contouring so I'm using the brown eyeshadow from the same palette and I'm going to contour a little with your lower lash line so I'm using the same brown eyeshadow from the palette not the same the lightest brown shade from the palette and I'm going to run it under my eyes to have a balanced look and I'm going to repeat it on on the both eyes and now it's time to put on mascara so for today I'm using this etude blush it is such a nice pinky shade and for the highlighter I'm using this chrome blush by essence and I'm using it as a highlighter for the lips I'm using today a Renault nude lipstick and voila our finished makeup look is done so let me show you my outfit this is a beautiful dress by generation it has beautiful embroidery on both the sides uh, like panels and this loop which is coming out it has to be tied and please ignore my carpet slippers so this is my finished look for eat today if you like my makeup look so don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and ignore my carpet slippers please so i will see you in my next video take care bye bye have a nice eat